Hello everyone, this is Varietistic and in this video I want to show you how to bypass the Google account FRP protection for the hard reset and this is happens when you do a hard reset for the phone and you don't remember with the Gmail account so you have to log in with the same Gmail account that you had synced to this device. So if you don't remember, I'm going to show you in this video how you can bypass the Gmail account for the LG Tribute HD for Boost Mobile. Now, let me tell you, this is maybe the, the easiest Google bypass I have ever done before. And I want to show you how you can do it. Very easy steps. But before we do this, I also want to pay your attention that I'm doing this video on the specific security patch. So what is going to happen after? Maybe LG, they're going to change the way that they Google bypass. And they may going to make it a little bit more difficult. But for now, I'm doing this video that would be in 2017. Today is January the 17th. This is how you have to do it. So if the LG push more security batches, it may change. If I get the chance, I will try to figure it out. But let's gonna go ahead and show you how you do it. Now, just go ahead and trying to uh, like trying to type something on a keyboard. You can just type anything randomly and hit and select like this, it got to be highlighted and go to the three dots over here and you're going to see assist. And the phone should take you to Google now. Now just say no thanks and then just go to setting. Just type settings and then do not go to the settings, go to the setup wizard. So go ahead and click the setup wizard. And let me also tell you something, you have to have either 4G connectivity to the phone or Wi-Fi, same as I'm doing right now. And then you're gonna go to this display. All you have to do, once you get there, just click on exit. And boom, you have bypassed the Google account, which is insane, it is so easy. Now, what I recommend to do, even if you have bypassed the Google account, I would say, Go ahead and do a factory reset. So go to the general and then uh, you go back up a reset and do a factory reset. Maybe you're going to get that boost stuff pop on the screen because this is the first time after we have made the Google bypass. But technically just do a factory reset. I'm going to try to do the factory reset as well. But I need to wait till this one uh, just finish the boost installation and stuff. Now after the boost uh, installation, whatever it is done, so we go ahead and do the factory reset. The phone should do factory reset with no any issues or problems. Go ahead and get hit delete and reset the phone. Now we're going to let the phone do the uh, factory reset and we will come back to you. Now the phone, we just done doing the factory reset. We're going to go through the wizard right now and uh, let me see, just hit next for now. And then next, one more time, take the protection and skip anyways. Try and go next, agree. And yeah, so the phone just pick back to uh, same as brand new software and there is no Gmail account or any bypass Google account in this phone. That was very much it for that video. I wish you guys find that video helpful and you enjoy watching it. If you did find it helpful, please do not forget to leave thumbs up. And if you would like to subscribe so you can watch more content like that. Thank you so much for watching everyone. As always, I'll, take, I'll talk to you in my next video.